conquer all of Middle Earth. Join the adventure. I mean, I guess we'll see. They don't really say exactly which genre of game it is. I guess we'll see. Ah, pretzels. Gotcha, gotcha. Are you up to date on Lord of the Rings show? No, I'm not. I only watched two episodes so far. No heels. That's okay. Who needs heals? Overrated. Battle commencing in ten. Heals and gold sounds optional to me. No problem. Five, four. No three, Omega Strikers today. Two, Most likely one. not. I'm not sure yet. Begin. Kinda depends how tired I am in an hour. I'm here. So we'll see. Do I ever take slow at one? Not often, but it's not bad if you really want it. Like, um, can be good against like a Diablo or something. Alright, I'm not going stacks this game then. I mean, no healer. I think I'm just gonna try to speedrun the game. And actually play well. Because this will maybe prove, uh, you know, we can, uh, we can experiment on my, uh, theory that I told you guys earlier where the draft doesn't really matter most of the time and you can win with any draft if people just focus on playing. We'll see how true that is here, I guess. You think yourself worthy to wield the Dragon Knight's power? Prove it. Take control of the shrines. Uh, KT is still running at me. Oh dear. Uh oh. But if you have a bad draft and bad play, though, you're screwed no matter what. Hopefully, uh, that doesn't happen. Of course. Capture the shrines. Inherit the Dragon Knight's power, and lay waste to this forsaken kingdom. Tickling your business brain. If Twitch wants to increase profits, why not make subs cost ten dollars? Oh, that's really easy. That is literally, you're literally talking about supply and demand. Basic concept of economics. Because the higher the price, the lower the demand. They increase the price of subs to $10, less people buy subs. Done. It's not going to be more profits if less people buy it. What they're doing now is basically streamers have no choice we are not very we're, we're essentially powerless right so what they're doing now is they're like taking candy from a baby like you know it's not streamers have much less ability like there's not much options for us they know they can get away with this but they know you know, a viewer has a lot more options. A viewer, you increase up to ten dollars, they just want up. But um, streamers, they take you know, they take two more dollars from us. We don't have great options. Most of us can't do anything about that. But I already spoke about this earlier. Like, it doesn't actually affect me because um, the threshold is like you have to have a lot of subs for it to affect you, and I don't have that many subs, not, not even close. So it doesn't actually affect me. This one, but. Yeah, that's why. Watch your back. The enemy's cooking something now. Look out. That area is unsafe. Can't you macro your way to victory on this map? Sometimes. Kind of depends on what the other team has. The other team has a god tier like wave player though. And they have good mercs. Like their off lane is good double soak, and and then multiple heroes in their four man as really good wave clear. So it's harder to just macro your way to victory when the other team is doing the proper thing. That's when you cannot macro your way to victory anymore. You stop being able to do that when the other team is also doing all the macro. So right now they're also doing all the macro, and they're doing it very quickly because their heroes are good at doing it. So. 
probably can't just AFK macro win this one. You weren't here yet? Oh yeah, no worries. I was just saying we were talking about it a little earlier. But yeah, nothing wrong with your question. But yeah, I mean, there's your answer. I mean, it's a very simple answer. It's because people wouldn't sub. Ready for the taking. Wow, these guys are just running this sport down, huh? They don't give a shit, okay. Holy moly. It's okay. Any draft can be a win. It's hots, baby. We can win with any draft. I'm 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 uh, I'm definitely going on damage control here in this game. Yeah, we don't want our team to freak out just yet. We're we're ahead, anyways. No reason for them to freak out, you know. Do a little babysitting, a little little reassurance for the babies. Um, that's true. It's it's not that we have no power. It's we have limited power. In order to switch platforms, we it's, it's, it's a big risk, right? It's a big risk, that's the thing. It's like, you don't know what your viewership will be. You don't know how, how your uh, economics will be if you switch platforms. So Twitch knows most people are, don't want to take that risk. So that's what it is. It's not that we have no power at all, but the power is not great right now because there's just a very big risk associated with switching platforms. Yeah, we don't have much leverage at the moment, at least. No! Oh, at least it hit something. I had the fattest four man silence, but I got slapped before I could activate it. Oh, but we got DK. Oh, I'm dead. I thought they were gonna go for the DK, and they're just down here chilling, going with me. What the heck? Well, DK got four. We'll take it. That's worth. Glorious. While the risk is real, you think most people don't think about that? They stay out of laziness more than anything. Oh, I heavily disagree with you on that. Heavily disagree. There's nothing to be lazy about here. All you have to do is press, you know, go go live. I mean, at most you spend a couple hours setting up the settings in your YouTube. Like it's it's this it's not hard to switch. Choose a talent. The problem is, we don't know what will happen if we switch. And if you do switch, if you do stream on YouTube, you can't stream on Twitch. Um, so like, it's, it's hard to even go back for a lot of people due to contracts and stuff. So I, I don't think it's laziness whatsoever. I think it's very much about the uncertainty. Especially if you're talking about full-time streamers. Like, full-time streamers, you're, you're saying they're too lazy to just spend two hours to, like, set up some stream settings? Like, no, there's no way. It's literally our jobs. It's, it's, it's not laziness. I'll be with you. Oh my god, I had a fat arrow again and I got slept again. This is just unlucky. I didn't even see that sleep. He didn't even see me. He just happened to angle it up. Tragic. Absolutely tragic. 
tragic city. Another chance to prove yourself. Omega late, bro. I was there was definitely more than three minions. I was I was soaking a full minion wave, brother. That's okay though. I might have to do that. They're not even pushing them. They're straight up just pushing mid instead of bottom is good for us. Fort lost. There must always be a dragon knight. But will it be you? Only fans, yeah, but I'm pretty sure no one would watch on OnlyFans. Let me tell you. They go to OnlyFans for a lot of things, but one of the things they don't go to OnlyFans for. I'm pretty sure no one goes to OnlyFans for HOTS, you know what I'm saying? Wait, wait. He hit me again. This Deckard is a sleep god! Never missed a sleep in his life! He's nuts! They're too close to their base. I think we bail him. No boy, no. Choose a talent. DJ Top. We should leave. You, okay, I need unstoppable. Sorry, I'm. That's a lot of words that are blurred out, dude. You wanna know what he's saying? What? <laughs> I have no idea what that even is. Yo, peace out, VPN. Thanks for uh, dropping by. Enjoy your lunch. Anyone else see this bad guy missing? Uh, awkward. But he also wasted his shit, so whatever. Yeah, we take it, we take it. Good enough. Mind if I interrupt? Troubles through. We'll do the tried and true split push. Self split push is always a good one. Uh, okay, I probably can't get much. Oh, actually, so he has that for 20 seconds. Yeah, screw it, I'm down. I fight on. P, thanks for gifting the sub to Barcode. Welcome, Barcode. Make sure you thank Blurpy. Hey, I got it. What a value push, dude. Now that's value. They are indeed feeding. Watch <laughs> My horse is a cow horse. Yeah, I didn't even notice. It was pretty cool actually. I like this horse. It's not even there. Smashing my face in instead. Match. Oh, okay. Well, you know. That's not good. We do have a keep advantage still, though. Could be worse? Question mark? 
You shall burn. Uh, another freebie, baby. Very big, very big. I'm surprised he didn't power blast me there. I died to a power blast there. I'm pretty sure. Oh, whatever. Keeps already dead. Might as well uh, clear this. I should probably keep picking people off, or my team is gonna like feed again, huh? Hey, I was trying to I kill that guy. For now. Well, that was rather entertaining. You're killing No way, bro, please. Tell me you at least kill this one. I can't believe killing that guy. This Johanna is the savior. With his dying breath, he chucked his shield at me. I will join you. It's called a Pinto horse. Oh, okay. What's my 2 do? It makes you unstoppable and it makes you have 40% move speed for 3 seconds. It's uh, generally the, considered the best Silk 16 by far if you are, you know, in a high, high skill game. Very important. You can make a lot of plays and uh, play very, get out of very dangerous situations with this. I just killed so many people. What the hell? It's crazy. Prepare yourselves, heroes. The shrines will soon be active again. One versus nine isn't feeling a little bit like a one versus nine game. Yeah. Feels a little bit that way. It's okay. There's no way they're all at our camp, though. I'll just pick pick off the stragglers. You can have that camp. I'll take your kill, Thas. She used my unstoppable too early there. Oh, that's a good gust though. We take those. Okay, I might as well heal them. Take those. Is that game? Oh, that is game. Let's game if we go top and end. Uh, there's no chance this team's going top and ending though, so let's just get DK. DK in camps. The gold way. It's the silver goldy low way. Why not? The Murden is kicking his ass, dude. An excellent strike. I tried to save this realm. Now it burns. Killing spree. Must have been headhunter, right? Yeah, I was headhunter. Ending topo. Oh wow, this guy actually walks straight to core. Telling me the golds know what a core is? Color me impressed. See, you can win no matter what your draft is. I mean, this game though was kind of like, like I carried these scrubs. Like, this is not the best game to demonstrate you can win with any draft. 
because uh, this was like they had bad play and they had a it was bad draft and bad play so this was more they just got carried but you can win with any draft even without getting carried if you just play well epic oh shit we're getting a lot of votes again look at that noise 